Hi, I'm Peter Raymond. And I'm Nancy Lang. We're here in uh, Stony Lake in Ontario, Canada. We're the co-directors of the film Margaret Atwood, A Word After Word After Word is Power. And the title of the film comes from a line in Margaret's, one of Margaret's poems, and we thought it apt as the power of her words have reached uh, people all over the world. We were really honored and delighted to make this film. Uh, Margaret Atwood invited us along on the, uh, for a year really, of filming with her and her partner Graham Gibson all around the world. She was insistent that the film not be just about her, but also be about Graham. Graham is also, as you'll learn in the film, Graham is a, also an author and writer. So the two of them together have done an enormous, and especially in Canada, have contributed enormously to our publishing world and our literary world. And little did we know when we started filming with them that the, we were documenting the last year of Graham's life. He passed away last September, just before the premiere of our film in Toronto. And since then, the film has gone out all over the world, and we're delighted it's being screened uh, uh, in Bologna. One of the greatest challenges in the film was when we started to do it, Margaret graciously allowed us to follow her in real time as she was, you know, traveling the world to her speaking engagements. Uh, but she was busy writing a new book and she said that she wouldn't be able to give us an interview for almost a year and a half after we began the film. So it was a challenge not to be able to do an, a lengthy interview, but following in real time was such an adventure uh, to see what she's like with her readers and, and um, particularly what she's like with her husband and her family. So we, got, felt, we felt it was quite an intimate portrayal of her and Graham. We feel the film is really very much a love story between them. And we've been very moved by how Margaret has reacted to the COVID-19 pandemic and what she's said about, you know, how we should use this time as a reset button on our lives and on, and on how we care for this planet. And let's hope that we come out of this, let's strive to come out of this pandemic uh, with a new relationship to each other and to the world. We hope you enjoy the film, and particularly you'll find that she's got a lot of fun and has this great sense of humor, and I think that's something that we hope all of you continue to carry on during this difficult time. Keep your chin up and keep smiling as much as you possibly can. Bye-bye from Canada.